Now, many people suffering from acid reflux may not even know it. There's an upcoming free event for anyone interested in learning more about the causes, symptoms, and treatments that's happening right here in Macon. Coliseum Northside Hospital's Sarah Jackson is here to tell us more about it. Good morning. Good morning. Sarah, what is acid reflux? You hear about people talk, you hear people talk about it pretty often, mm -hmm. but what exactly is it? Acid reflux very basically is the fact that between the esophagus and the stomach, the opening is too lax or too big. Uh, and that allows the stomach contents, which is mostly acid at most times, to reflux or backflow into the esophagus. That gives you esophagitis, which is extreme irritation. It can lead to a chronic cough. It can lead to heartburn. It can lead to an increase in asthma symptoms. You can wake up in the middle of the night coughing and feeling like you're drowning or choking. Oh, wow. Um, but a lot of people have different symptoms. Okay. Now, what causes that opening to be lax, like you said, or, or bigger? If we knew that, we could stop working because we don't know. Um, we really believe that that's a congenital or, or something that you're born with. It's, it's, it, it's something you have. Now, the acid that's coming back up is obviously what's causing the damage. It is. Now, how can we, how can, is that damage repairable once it's happened? The damage can, can heal itself over time, but you have to stop the reflux. The way to do that is with a minimally invasive surgical procedure. There are a couple of those. We do them at Coliseum Northside. You can temporarily take um, proton pump inhibitors. People know them as the purple pill or the over-the-counter uh, pills to reduce the acid. The problem there is that interferes with digestion of food. It also interferes with absorption of vitamins. So you need to fix the problem, not just mask the symptoms. Right. You talk about some of the, the problems that you see right away. What are, I guess, the long-term effects? What happens if, if this goes untreated? If you continue with this, a great many people will end up with severe um, esophagitis, which is um, a very, very bad inflammation of the esophagus. They can end up with what's called Barrett's esophagus, which is beyond just esophagitis. It's the precursor to esophageal cancer. Oh. So we don't want you to get there. We want you to get, get, get your problem fixed before you get that far. Now, do the things that you just mentioned, does that affect your speech? Does it affect It can how give you, eat? you a cough. It can give you um, a sore throat. Uh, it can deepen your voice because your vocal cords are being fried all the time. Um, it can make you change your diet um, because you will find that some foods more than others um, will give you more heartburn or will give you more reflux. Um, one of the ways that you can lessen it is to uh, not lie down uh, after you eat for several hours. Um, but unless you want to do that forever, the best thing to do is to have the problem fixed. Now, before we run out of time, I definitely want to tell our folks about this upcoming Lunch and Learn next week. Are you go will you guys be sharing any procedures that can kind of help people that are suffering? We will. Um, next Wednesday, January 8th, Dr. John Bagnato will be uh, teaching a Lunch and Learn. Uh, at Coliseum Northside um, at noon. We ask that you make reservations. It is free to the public, um, but we do need to know how many people will be there so we can feed you. Awesome. Um, and he will explain a, a lot more uh, detailed um, explanation of what GERD is, um, what you do about it, a couple of ways that we can help it, and a couple of methods um, in which we can fix it. Great, a lot of interesting information. Thank Good you for being on the show. Now to learn more about acid reflux, again, just head to the Lunch and Learn. It's Wednesday, January 8th at Coliseum Northside Hospital. The educational seminar is free. Registration is required. For more information, just call 746-4646.